you have three minutes to speak and the rules of decorum continue to apply. You may begin speaking now. Okay, thank you very much. Good morning, Judge and Commissioners. My scripture message this morning was 1 Corinthians chapter 1, verse 10, that you shall speak the same thing and that there be no division among you, but that you be joined together in the same mind and the same judgment. I'm not specifically talking about Jesus, but to the laws that were revealed to our founders and to which you swore an oath, that oath to protect and defend our Constitution, which was written to protect our Creator-given unalienable rights. Why do I bring this up again? Because there are those in our state that are violating our rights, rights until recently that were sacrosanct between ourselves and our doctors, our right to choose how we protect our unalienable right to life. There are appointed board members to the Texas Medical Board that are usurping those God-given rights. Rights to choose medications, medications that have been approved by the FDA for 65 years to treat illness or threats of impending illnesses. It is this one person who is creating division among all Texans, divisions on how we choose to defend our right to life. Whenever one man chooses to usurp God's law, bad things happen. Bad things that have happened throughout the history of man Bad things has happened last century with the murder of 150 million civilians by Marxist communists. Bad things that have happened recently in Texas by the 6,000 plus excess deaths due to a refusal of medication and medical care. Care that this body could have protected had you chosen to nullify illegal orders to ban legal medicines that would have prevented chaos and excess deaths, even deaths that have yet to be counted, that we are experiencing today. This is why Senator Angela Paxton has joined Senator Bob Hall in calling the Texas Medical Board President, Sarah Z. Zafran, to be part of one body that obeys their oath to protect and defend the Constitution which was written to protect and defend our God-given unalienable rights. When men, especially appointed men, like Drs. Fauci and Zafran, play God and usurp God's laws, bad things happen, like the de deaths of 6,000 and counting innocent Texans. Thank you very much. I appreciate the opportunity. Thank you, Mr. Brewer.